Good morning. Happy Sunday to you guys. I just finished making um, kind of like a, I guess, brunch by now. It's 10.45, so brunch time, I guess. I made a vegetable stir-fry. It's got a lot of yummy, yummy veggies in there. Michael is not a fan of squash. I would like to add some zucchini someday, but... So there's no meat in it? There's no meat. Goma. Oh, I guess you need a fork. Just maybe. I'm not quite sure what the plan is for today. I think we're gonna go to watch a movie, Michael and I, and then um, probably, I don't know, I'm thinking to take Joshua to the park because it's sunny out. And that would be, Good idea. That, yeah, right? We take him to the park. And yeah, I didn't get much sleep last night. I went to bed at like two, and then I was up at eight o'clock. So, I mean, I guess six hours is better than what I've been doing, what I've been getting lately. Boyo, do you want some? Food? It's just so difficult to get this little boy to eat veggies. He ate, um... He already ate? He ate, uh, Oh, okay. Okay. One... Two... Three... Four... Five... Six... Seven... Eight... Are you waving by? I can't even see him. You like the movie, huh, babe? Oh, really? <laughs> Say bye. See you next time. Hi, babies. What you doing? What you doing? Hi. Hi, pretty. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> I'm here at Fred Meyer. Michael's grabbing some food um, at this little place right that's kind of connected to this. Ooh, this is cheap. But I was needing to pick up a really good lotion. There's one that my the chick who did my uh, manicure and pedicure yesterday told me to pick up and I cannot find it. So looks like mama's gonna have to do something else, which is fine. I also picked up some granola and then more diapers for Joshua. Hopefully this will be the last pack of diapers I ever have to buy for him. And down here I've got some vitamin E oil. My great grandmother put vitamin E on her face every single night before bed and that woman died at like 70 something with zero wrinkles on her face. And my, my grandma now is the same exact way. So, you know, take, take, take the advice from your grandma ladies. They kind of know what they're talking about. <laughs> All right, so we just got home from the store. We actually went to go watch um, Warm Bodies and took the babies with us. <laughs> no, I know, they actually do really well in the theaters, both of them do. I mean, you can only expect a child to sit so quietly for an hour and a half, but they both do really well, as long as Joshua has a little something to like snack on, and Alyssa obviously, her snack is like built into me, so. I mean, they do really well in the theaters. Cute movie, did you like it? Mm -hmm. It's a cute movie. Um, and then we went to the store, and I guess I can show you guys what I picked up. Michael, my darling husband, was in desperate need of socks. I honestly don't remember the last time you bought socks. It's been that long. Since you came back from boot camp, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's been <laughs> before Joshua was born was the last time Michael bought socks, so that was desperately needed. And then somehow they start reproducing. The socks? Yeah. They start getting socks. Just from everywhere. Socks. And none of them match. There's a big bag of socks. I don't know. Maybe the washer and dryer. The dryer is having babies. Instead of eating ours, it's having babies, but none of them match. And then he got this. Um, I guess his hands are too big for the controller for the PS3. So not, not so much too big. I, just, I want to try something that looks a little more comfortable. Oh, well, anyways, he picked this up. It looks like an Xbox controller, but it's a PS3 controller. And... The soundtrack for Les Mis, is this from the movie or from, the, oh, okay, that's great. That's really good. If you guys haven't seen this movie, you need to go see it immediately. Stop watching this vlog and go see it. Just kidding. <laughs> and then I got this uh, Bodycology Toasted Vanilla Sugar by, oh, it's a body scrub. See, dang it, I thought I was picking up the, um, 
lotion. Well, it's all right either way. Now I'll smell extra vanilla-y. We all know I like to smell like I'm a like I'm fresh out of the oven, and this will definitely do it. I have the um, like the body spray thing, so it's like layering. That's my theory when it comes to like stuff that you buy, like fragrances and stuff. When you buy the Vanilla Bean Noel, you have to buy the body spray, the lotion, and the like shower gel, and that's how you make your scent last all day. It's probably common knowledge, but for those of you who don't know, I got a uh, just a top coat and a base coat. The chick that did my nails yesterday was like, girl, you're crazy. You need, to need, you need a base coat. And like I said, I got some vitamin E oil, babe. I'm going to be a hot grandma. I'm just telling you, that's my mission in life, is to age with no wrinkles. My great-grandma did it. <laughs> my grandma and Sylvia's doing it. I know that I can look like I'm 25 when I'm really, like, 40. I'm lucky. And then, again, some diapers for Joshua. Hopefully that will be the last one. And, yeah, that's all that we got. Uh, put that stuff away in a little while before my granola gets soggy. Michael is picking out. What are you having? I, I mean, I try not to get something too greasy or anything. No, I know. I'm just saying. You're eating. It's short ribs. Short ribs. He went to this Hawaiian place. And? Yummy. And then um, I've, of course, got my non-fat vanilla yogurt with some... I got cherry granola this time. Mm -hmm. So I thought I would try something a little bit different. And my babies are sleeping, which means hallelujah time. <laughs> I think that's a little bit better. So I just um, finished washing my face. I got no makeup on and I wanted to show you guys um, what I was going to do with this stuff right here. Now I used this uh, body ecology scrub that I got earlier on my face and basically it's kind of like similar. It, I wasn't going to, I just opened it to see like what it felt like and um, it's kind of similar to the exfoliator that I normally do, like that I make myself, you know, with uh, olive oil and sugar. So I was just like, okay, well, let's try this on my face. And it, oh my God, my face feels like a baby's nalgas. Like it's really, really soft. Um, I don't have super sensitive skin, so um, this might be something that I will be wanting to use more often. I just, Figured that since it's very similar in texture, I might as well try it out and see what happens. So that is what I did. So if I'm looking like uber red right now, that is why. But I was going to show you guys what I do with, or what I'm going to be doing with this uh, pure vitamin E oil. Now, like I was saying, my great grandma had the most beautiful, perfect, supple, yeah, supple. That's a weird word to say. <laughs> um, like, just the most amazing skin, even when she died. And so, um, what's it called? You know, asking my grandmama. She said that that was what her secret was. So, I'm going to start using this because I don't want to get old. When I turned 20, that was just one of those things that I was like, oh my god. I feel like age. I feel like just like 80 years old already. So... Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put some of this on, maybe show you guys really quickly if I can set up the stripe up. So all I did was, um, if you guys saw, all I did was I just got some of it and like um, just kind of did like this thing a little bit so I could get a little bit onto my fingers, warmed it between my fingers and then just kind of like did that kind of thing. And I only put enough to where it's um, like it's on there but I don't look wet. Do you know what I mean by that? By like oil, I don't look greasy, I don't look wet. It's just enough to be on there and I know that it's on there. Um, 
What was I going to say? What was I going to say? I don't remember what I was going to say. But anyways, yeah, so that is what I did. I know that you can buy it in, like, the capsule form, and that's what, um, I think my mom even did that a while back. That's what she used to do. But that's what I would do for, like, stretch marks in my belly region. Um, and actually, now that I think about it, I should use it to kind of lighten up some of uh, the ones that I have right here. That's such a genius. Anyway, so yeah. I'm going to continue to do that, see if that makes a difference. I don't, I mean, I'm only 21 and I don't have, like, real wrinkles yet, but, like, prevention is, prevention's, prevention is where it's at, where it is at, guys. And, yeah, I'm waiting for my husband. He's still playing, doing the usual story of my life, playing his video game. And, yeah, let's go see if I can, let's go see if I can get his attention. Great. 